Banks, and welcome back. We're here with Patricia Rose, star of Ninja Huntress 3. We just saw a clip right before the break. Patricia, I have to say, you get more and more beautiful every time you're on the show. You look just like a rose. <laughs> uh, you are sort of doubling up on this tour with uh, promoting the film and also promoting this new cause that you've uh, started, I believe. Uh, American actors facing irresponsible lemonade stands. What's that all about? Awful. Um, we've been really advocating to end lemonade stands by children. How so? Why? Kids are developing a false sense of responsibility from lemonade stands. And I really do think that's why we have so many problems with the economy today. They're just trying to sell uh, their lemonade, five cents a cup, I guess with inflation, that's what I sold it for. Uh, they're probably selling it more for $1.75 and they probably have it in small, grande, and vente, right? <laughs> Something like that. Well, when you're younger and you have a lemonade stand, you end up getting money from your parents, getting money for a product that nobody really wants, you oh. know? And if you want it, why are you gonna buy it from a kid who, who doesn't know the correct amount of sugar to water? That so you it's put? something for nothing. Right, Isn't that exactly. the American dream? It's keeping kids on the street and off the street at the same time, right? But there are probably more than a few parents out in the audience who have kids with lemonade stands. It gets them out of the house, huh? I just find it's very dangerous for entrepreneurs and the future of America to have kids raised in this way. Lemonade stands are really ruining this country. Uh, on, on that topic, uh, people being able to get a little something for nothing, a new product called Virul. Have you ever tried the product? No, I haven't tried it. Yet. Virul, as you know, is a new product that allows you to become an instant sensation. And I understand that you have got more than a few things to say about it. Uh, you know what, I think it's getting a little bit ridiculous. Well, ridiculous, uh, you know, that can be a good thing. It's entertaining. I mean, take, for example, Margaret Ames, the dishwashing woman. That's a great video. You gotta admit, it's a great video. Come on, she's washing the dishes. You think she's gonna dry them? She keeps washing the dishes. Yeah, it's fantastic. Okay. I spent my whole life trying to get famous. People like me who have training and talent and have worked their whole lives to reach this celebrity status are getting lost in the crowd of thousands and thousands of famous people who did not earn it yeah. the right way. Yeah, but you gotta admit, Dishwashing Woman, that's a great video. Yeah, it's a great video. <laughs> Your co-star in this movie is also a relatively new presence in the entertainment industry. There have been allegations, potential viral use. You know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna declare this to everybody out there right now. Jonathan Johns is not using viral. <gasps> Okay, he has talent. He acts from his heart. And yes, he got lucky, but I think he did it the clean way. Well, are you sure I'm not on the viral right now? <laughs> Nick, that's not even that's not even funny. No, I'm just kidding you, Patricia. I didn't want to ruffle your feathers too much. I, uh, you know, just like to talk about these things, get them out in the open. But uh, I do hope that you'll come and watch Ninja Huntress Three in theaters now. Uh, the beautiful, ever charming Patricia Rose with us once again. Thanks again. Oh, my